Back now with a word of warning about motorcycle safety in one Hampton Road city. Virginia Beach has seen a rash of crashes, but the last straw was one involving a police officer last week on Dam Neck Road. More importantly, five of the nine deadly crashes in the city this year involve motorcycles. Ten of your sides, Kara Dixon has more now on this safety crackdown. Virginia Beach Police want to remind motorcyclists about safety on the roadways, especially after one of their own officers was injured in a crash just last week. Police bikes are designed to take a beating, but not necessarily quite this kind of beating. The motorcycle parked at the Virginia Beach City Garage is a reminder of how quickly a ride can go wrong. You can see that it slid for quite a distance. Sergeant Brian Ricardo, who's in charge of the department's motorcycle unit, showed us the bike his officer was riding when he was sideswiped last week. The day that our officer was hit, our officer was responding to a serious injury motorcycle crash right down the street off of Damneck Road. And officers are responding to an increasing number of those crashes. Ricardo says they've already had 130 calls from January to July of this year. That's up from 103 during the same time last year. The last thing we want to do is, as police officers, especially motorcycle officers, is respond to a fellow motorcycle crash. Police say out of the nine fatal accidents in the city, five involve motorcyclists. Ricardo says they were caused by driver error. Riders are riding beyond their capabilities. Maybe they're riding in weather conditions when they shouldn't be riding, or maybe they're even riding when they're drunk or otherwise under the influence of something and when they shouldn't be riding. He wants bikers to be more aware of what they can handle, and he also wants drivers to be on the lookout to prevent crashes he says occurs a lot at stoplights. Give it that one extra pulse, Make sure it's clear before you actually go through the green light. While that officer injured last week is recovering and already back at work, Ricardo says it's also important to give police motorcyclists the respect and the distance they need. If you happen to see us running lights and sirens on a motorcycle, then give us that little bit of extra room so that we can get through intersections. Virginia Beach police say regardless of if you're driving a motorcycle or another vehicle, you should never drive while under the influence. I'm Kara Dixon, 10 on your side.